Got Smith. somebody in the wall. Caution has come out. Greg Biffle has hit the wall. Man, this is going to change things now. That four seconds you were talking about? Gone. How about the 10 seconds? Gone. Now Stewart's got guys in his mirror that have four tires. And if inside of 10 to go, it's a single file restart. No lap cars in the way. Four to go as they take the green. Stewart leads at Texas. Wow, and Harvick left the door open on the right side, so Jimmy Johnson's going to get one of those spots in a hurry. Johnson in the 48 around Harvick in the 29, chasing race leader Tony Stewart. Does That's he not what Stewart wanted to see. Trust me, he's looking in the mirror for that 48 car. He wants to know where he's at. Riggs runs second, but here comes Johnson on those four fresh tires. Yeah, if he gets by Riggs here this lap without too much trouble, Tony's going to be a sitting duck. Tony's having a little trouble. Yep. He might get positioned down the oh, back oh, trailer. Bobble a little bit there with Riggs. And that holds up Johnson. Couldn't find the avenue to get by. Kevin Harvick's going to go low. Riggs can't block them both. Johnson gets the position. Oh, he's getting them loose. Oh. He's getting them loose. And it Riggs is around hard into the wall. Caution is out. Oh, Kenseth goes, goes around. around. Kenseth, another championship chaser. Jeff Gordon is through the grass. Scott Riggs running second. Now a hard hit sits in the middle of the trioval here at Texas. But the race isn't over. Under NASCAR rules, we will have a green, white checker. We have two more laps. And that's not good news for Tony Stewart, but it's good news for Jimmy Johnson. There's Harvick right behind Riggs. That was an extremely hard blow. There's a rear spring bouncing across the racetrack. It'll take a while to clean this up. Jimmy Johnson took four tires under his most recent pit stop. Tony Stewart took two. Green flags in the air. Two laps to decide it at Texas. Johnson hangs with Stewart on the start, looks at the high side, then ducks in behind him. Flash bulbs everywhere. Stewart low, Johnson high. Harvick in third. And Kyle Busch and Clint Boyer earn her junior sixth. Tony Stewart has been strong all day, has led 277 of the 338 laps. White flag, last lap. Pretty even that lap. I think he's going to be able to get him. Doesn't look that way. Down the back stretch for the final time. Tony Stewart won last week at Atlanta with a dominating run, strong pit stops, a good crew. Outside the chase for the next Dell Cup championship, cannot defend his title, but he can be strong down the stretch. Tony Stewart wins at Texas. I told him he better get him a mattress. He better get what? A mattress to put on the racetrack yeah. underneath. One of these days he's going to slip. Hart Jr. with an amazing run. Tony Stewart climbs the fence to the flag stand and will celebrate with the fans. For those of you who want to continue watching NASCAR racing from Texas, please tune to CNBC for our post-race report. And coming up next on NBC, it's Football Night in America with Bob, Chris, Sterling, and the bus for all of today's NFL action leading up to Sunday Night Football. Our race coverage continues on CNBC. Football Night in America is next.
That's a great win for the team. Let's keep it up.